Good evening, it's our final night in Jeddah and tonight we're going to the promenade, otherwise known as the Corniche. Abdul? Yes. Where? Hi, Salam alaikum. Thank you, Abdul. Shukran. So we've been dropped off right at the top of the corniche or the promenade, right opposite Al Rama Mosque, which is otherwise known as the Floating Mosque. So that's just in front of us here. So as we walk down here, we've got the Formula One circuit to our left. So hopefully we'll be able to have a little look at that at one point. Don't know if it's gonna be blocked off at all. It's a street circuit, but I imagine it's gonna be blocked off. So to the left of me, there's just loads and loads of tables and chairs. There's no cafe at all. Just loads of tables and chairs just for people to sit down and, and I think they bring their own stuff. It's quite a nice thing that they have in sort of Islamic countries, isn't it? It is, yeah. Lots of social areas where people can just bring their picnics, bring their tea, their coffee, and just chill out together. It's nice. So you can see part of the F1 circuit, right just across the road here, just there. So this is the northern end of it and it goes down there by quite a few kilometers. So what we can see on all these tables is people with their picnics and, and all their food that they've got for when the sun sets and then they can end their fast because obviously it's still Ramadan here. So all the families have come out and they're just sitting together waiting. I don't know, you can't see the sun at the moment but I imagine they know what time the sun goes down. They'll do a prayer and then they'll eat for the first time since, well before the sun was down I guess. Sun, yeah, before sunrise. Yeah, before sunrise. Here you can see they've got all their food and everything ready ready to eat. It's making me quite hungry actually. I imagine what a lot of them are going to eat is Casper, which is Casper, not Casper the friendly ghost, but Casper with a K. And that's a mix of rice, beef, yeah beef, maybe lamb, vegetables and spices. You have people on tables, chairs, blankets over there and they've brought so much food out. It's amazing. So they've probably just cooked this at home during the day and then just bring it all. It's just really nice to see, I think, isn't it? Yeah, especially rather than just staying at home and eating, it's nice to actually come out and do it. Usually the whole family as well. Yeah. So we're just going to go into Starbucks and, well, it's, it's open and we can get something, but we're, we're going to wait for half an hour until everyone else can eat because I think it's just kind of disrespectful to eat in front of people who have been fasting all day. Like no water, no water, food, cigarettes, no sex, no thinking inappropriately. So yeah, that's what I read. So in front of me is the, I think it's the grandstand of the Formula One track, just here. Uh, I don't think we're getting any closer than this. So the track is currently to our left. Maybe this is as close as we'll get. Although for a street circuit, there's definitely not much traffic on it. I don't think it should be called a street circuit. It's 
getting really, really windy and there's a few droplets in the sky. I really hope it doesn't rain for it now. We've been waiting this long for me and then it's, it's picking up. It's picking up. Uh, oh no. Uh, uh, there's a storm coming in. Yeah, the sun has gone down and now everyone is eating. Thank God, I'm sure they're going to eat very fast and get back in their cars. Oh, do you want to maybe keep it down? <laughs> no worries. Seven o'clock and now we're hungry, so Gotta look for something to eat. Hopefully Casper, but... Oh, there's falafel there. Maybe oh, falafel. Yeah. That cat's not having any. We ended up going to the Moroccan restaurant and we've got falafel, chips... Okay. Chips. Yeah, falafel <laughs> and chips. Yeah, nice. We've also got Alsi Cola and B Cola. Are they any good? Yeah, both pretty much the same. <laughs> that was some underwhelming falafel, wasn't it? It was, yeah, it wasn't great. <laughs> yeah, especially for the Middle East as well. Like, you'd expect better. But hey, what are you going to do? Only cost three quid. We're going to continue walking south. Mm -hmm. Yeah, south, just down the promenade. Also, I just forgot, but it's March the 18th today, so it's my mate's birthday. So happy birthday, the Josh Dixon. <laughs> happy birthday, Dixon. Take away, cat. Eat this. We're going to keep walking further south but to be honest it's taken ages Jeddah is a very big city but we've really enjoyed ourselves here it's been really good time hasn't it yeah really surprising actually pleasantly surprising yeah very pleasantly surprising yeah definitely want to come back really really nice thanks for watching goodbye from me goodbye from Jeddah <laughs> <laughs>